We joined volunteers in Ohio of the United States as they braved 30 centimeters of snow to hold a Lunar New Year celebration. Meanwhile, in Malaysia, city volunteers in both Pontian and Kota Tinggi hosted separate celebrations to ring in the Chinese New Year. Here's more. Here at the Lunar New Year celebration in Pontian, Malaysia, city volunteers have prepared a wide variety of activities. Among them are introductions to Tsuji, as well as a tea serving area. Most importantly is a sutra performance that on stage volunteers have been practicing over the past two months. Time is easily managed when you have the heart to do so. I have more free time at night, so I came to join the sutra performance. The community members in this sutra performance are glad to be participating, despite some of them being older or having difficulty with the movements. Basic clients during the day, so on the nights we have practice. I hurry to rehearsal when my work is complete because I want to set a good example for others to follow. This white ox cart is for sentient beings and bodhisattvas. In order for the cart to seat more bodhisattvas, I thought it would be best if I helped to fill it out. The same warm celebrations took place at the Kota Tinggi's Ulu Tiram High School. Our volunteers showed footage on Xie Kunshan, the mouth and foot painter. The video inspired me. It taught me that we should not be defeated by seemingly impossible problems in life. We need to overcome our difficulties. I've learned that when I come across a difficult situation, I should not give up so easily. I can come up with a solution. Through games and activities, students learn a bit more Jinx aphorisms as volunteers hope to plant seeds of compassion in the hearts of these students. Meanwhile, in the United States, at the Chinese New Year celebration hosted by Tsuji Columbus Liaison Office in Ohio, over a hundred volunteers, including Ohio State University Tsuchings, participated in a sutra performance. These performers have practiced for six weekends to prepare for the big day. Though obstacles came up on the day of the performance, volunteers overcame them all. To reach the venue, volunteers had to drive through 30 centimeters of snow. Upon arrival, volunteers quickly set it up with the city's signature touch. A Mill Run Gardens and Care Center representative also brought a donation collected from the seniors of the center to show their appreciation. The time you give us keeps giving through our seniors. In conclusion, I would like to sincerely thank you from our seniors for recognizing them as people of value. Everyone prays for a world free from disaster, as they hope the lamp of the heart will help to guide their spiritual path.